Um, I think any time you can get people out of name, rank, and serial number, automaticness, you're getting people to be humans with you. And so that's, that's the struggle. So I would say start testing it. Like you're gonna go up and try to meet five people during the break and ask them, um, try them all out. Try, you know, and everybody's heard the talk, so hopefully they'll respond with their heart. But um, ask them, you know, um, what brings you joy? How do you like to spend your time? Um, what made you laugh recently? Try all those questions and see what happened. Now everybody has prepared answers, but at least you'll get to practice in a safe place. What brought you here today um, is not bad. Um, it just there are some facile answers to that. I like things that don't really have a facile answer, if you know what I mean. What brought you here today? Uh, I saw it on Eventbrite. <laughs> you know, but if I, don't, I haven't seen you in so long, I've lost track of what you're up to, then I might just ask, uh, what's the last awesome thing that you saw? That's such an easy question. Awesome's colloquial. Nobody's freaked out by it. I'm not asking you to open up your heart and bleed. But, because, um, you know, this can get a little touchy-feely. But I find that's a really easy one, you know? What's the last awesome thing that happened? What's the last awesome thing that you saw? Um, has anything magical happened lately? Depending on if I'm talking to my game design nerd friends. Because, you know, they're willing to talk about magical events. <laughs> well, uh, I have bad news for you. You're a woman, and everybody thinks everything you do is aggressive. <laughs> Sorry, that was that's a very okay. bitter comment. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I have to go to the bathroom. My God, she's pushy. <laughs> <laughs>